Ladies and gentlemen, what is up and welcome to today's premium disappointment crystal opening. It is a pretty big one today. I think we have about 57 crystals to open. Uh, we recently have had Iceman added as well as Psylocke and Archangel. So today we're on the hunt for like any three of the new mutant characters. That'd be amazing as a four star. But if not, like uh, there's still quite a few four star characters like Hood I'd love to pick up. And also Awakening Gwenpool would be sweet as well. But really like like when it comes to premiums we will take any form of four star so we're gonna do the usual ritual of you know considering we got 50 in a bit to open we're gonna spin 20 of them and then we're gonna rapid open the rest of them so let's go ahead and see what the reel is looking like today i'm just trying to think like who's added next week i think it's um it's angela then king root right so yeah damn these are getting pretty good uh over the course of the uh the next few few weeks who else do we have coming? So we have Angela, King Groot, pretty good to pick up. Then we're going to like, uh, what is it, Nebula and Yondu. And then we got like, what is it, Carnage and Punisher 2099. Mm, maybe not so great. And we got Spider-Man after that. So that's going to be sick, but it's still going to be a while before he's added to uh, all of the crystals anyway. But aside from that, we just need like uh, a few more free star characters. Like if we could get at least three free star characters in this opening which hopefully we will out of like 50 something then it means later on today or maybe at some point tomorrow we can do a triple four star opening and that's going to hopefully yield a bit of a higher chance to get you know the Iceman or the Archangel because if I get either two of those characters we currently have seven T4 uh, CCs for the mutant class so it means that we can take up both straight up to rank, uh, rank five and that'd be really really incredible. But I think uh, before that, I'd probably wait for the five-star Iceman opening to see if we get a five-star Iceman. But uh, yeah, we're going to have to see, you know, how that one goes. Like tomorrow, I'm going to do quite a bit of practice this evening. But tomorrow, if everything is going well, we're going to start like three back-to-back -back runs, a Labyrinth of Legends. Because i got three more runs left total. Uh, so it'd be really really good to finish it, but like every path we have to do like there's just so much ball lake in the way So yeah, really really not looking forward to that I mean, we've got one path of like spider-man and we've got one path with Electra, and I also think another run of Doctor Strange on that one and then Moon Knight and then we have uh, What is it? The juggernaut and rhino one. So yeah, we got some uh, we got terrible paths left some of the worst ones so yeah, I can't wait to do those live. That's going to be a lot of fun. But I think that'll be starting from tomorrow. Unless I wake up tomorrow and I just cannot play this game for the life of me. But hopefully we're going to play pretty good tomorrow. So we'll see how we go. So yeah, we've had some terrible luck so far. Six crystals, all two stars. It's kind of to be expected, but it'd be nice if we could get four star. In the first ten, oh, I wouldn't have mined some more. Juke levels on the Dormammu then. Like, he's been raking in kills as an Alliance War Defender. And I've still got him at rank 4. I'd love to take him up to rank 5. I might do that soon, but I feel like I want to take Magic up to rank 5 before I take Dormammu up. Just because Magic, like, I really, really like playing Magic. She's a lot of fun. And also, I'm going to wait and see. Like, this is because, you know, there's a, a chance from the, uh, what is it? The, um, the Iceman Crystal that we are spinning on. It's not tomorrow, it's Thursday. Uh, that we could get something like Awakening Our Magic, we could pull like a Mordo, or maybe like a Dormammu or a Hood, because you know it's the sub feature pull whenever you go for a featured champion. So yeah, we might get something really, really good there, so I'm being a little bit conservative. Oh no! Right, that was a terrible batch of 10 crystals. So, so disappointing. Right, so we didn't get, like, anything good there. Just a load of two-star trash. What a great way to start it. Right, so let's uh, go for another turn, and hopefully we can get a little bit lucky. As you can see, you know, we're not too far off, like a triple four-star opening. So at least some three stars would be pretty good. But if we could straight up pull, like, a four-star Iceman or Archangel, that would be kind of the, the main thing that we're after. Two-star Wolverine. Ah, that's all right. He's at max pupil level, so it gives us... Um, Additional max signature uh, crystal. I'm thinking of those crystals because I've, I've got like 70 at the moment. But, you know, I just keep on getting them quicker and quicker because there are a lot of characters. that are kind of edging towards cube level 99. I might just save up. Like, I think it's either going to be 250 or 500. And do like a really, really massive opening when we get to that. 
kind of stage to try and hunt for, I don't know, some exciting goodies or like a more Iron Fist or something like that. But it'd be nice to do like a really, really big opening for those because most of the time it is shards that you get. So I want to see like uh, from like hundreds and hundreds of them, you know, are you going to get many signature stones, awakening gems, stuff like that. So that's kind of what we're waiting to see on. All right, let's go for crystal number 14. At least something a little bit silver. Damn. These really are premium disappointment today. We are getting absolutely shat on. If I get like 57 two-star champions today, I'm going to be a little bit salty, ladies and gentlemen, for sure. Right, let's pop this one off. See what we get. Oh, that one had a little bit of a delayed spin. Maybe something good. And it's it's going to be a Black Widow, isn't it? I wouldn't, wouldn't have mind awakening my Venom Pole from a premium. Like, that would have been too bad. I mean, like, I probably still wouldn't use Venom Pool outside of Arena for points, but, you know, it would it would be relatively nice. Right, Crystal number 16. Anything good coming around? A two-star Hulkbuster. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Great. I realized that today, actually, I don't have a, um... Still don't have a four-star Hulkbuster. I kind of want one, because I got the two-star, got the three-star, got the five-star. I just need, like, yeah, a four-star Hulkbuster... I guess, you know, there are there are champions like Archangel Nice Man that, you know, obviously I want a little bit before that, but it would be nice to add to the collection because then I can make a team of like four Hulkbusters and a Hulk. And that'll look, you know, that'll be a pretty badass screenshot to tweet out. So I would appreciate getting that. Oh, really? Man, we almost got the free star Iceman there. Would have appreciated the dupe levels on that. Can't believe you've almost opened 20 now. It's crystal number 19, and we haven't even got a free star. Really, really terrible odds so far. Oh, it's another two star. Really? Damn. I'm hoping our luck just completely flips, like, when it comes to the rapid popping stage. Like, I really, really do need that. Okay, let's, let's go for this one. Hopefully, it's going to be sound pretty damn good. And we are landing on a... It's a two-star four, by the look of it. Great. Fun times. At least we, we raked in a few max signature ability crystals there. Damn, though. That's been bad so far. So it's been 20 crystals and 22 stars. Let's go for the first round of five. Let's see what we get here. Right. Hey, we got a four-star black ball. Hey, not too bad. Not too bad. So that awakens black ball for the very first time there. Just awesome. Gives us some more shards. Because I'm still like a thousand short for, uh, what is it, the five-star Iceman at the moment. But I've still got 100% master mode to do, which we can do in that space of time. So yeah, that's good. That's that's good. Like, yeah, it's it's not too bad. So yeah, 20, 24 two stars and one four-star at the moment. So we're going on to 30 right about now. So let's go for another batch of five. And some more gold. Let's, let's see what we get here. Right, okay, so we got two free stars. We got a Scarlet Witch and an Iron Man. So Scarlet Witch, that is a uh, very nice max signature stone for that character, which is awesome. So yeah, that was certainly was a, a pretty decent round. Like, the luck has re it's really, like, flipped. <laughs> uh, totally flipped on its head since we've started rapid popping. Maybe this is the way to go. Right, let's go for another five. So this brings us up to 35. Let's see uh, what this batch yields. Okay, so we got a three-star Luke Cage. Damn, son. We are we're getting all of the luck today, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, this has certainly picked up quite a bit since we've started rapid opening. All right, let's go for another batch of five. So this takes us up to 40, right? Awesome. So let's pop these five open. So at 40 so far, we've got three three-star characters and one four-star. Right, yeah, it's not going too bad. So 36 two stars. It's, it's all right. I'm, I'm very happy with the four star, to be honest. Like, Awakening Black Bowl, I'll, I'll take that. You know, I, I needed that for the collection. Let's go for another five and see what we get. So this brings us up to 45. Hey, look at that. We got a four star guillotine. So double four star. Damn, that is amazing. I, we could potentially make this triple four star for sure. Right, so that is, that's sweet. I'm very, very happy about that. I think Guillotine is actually quite high in terms of her sick level now. I feel like I've pulled her a few times. So yeah, let's go for another batch of five. So what was that? Two four stars and three three stars right about now. I think this brings us up to 50. Let's see what we get. 
Okay, yeah, so that's fine. I, I feel like for the rest of this, we're just going to get absolutely crapped on, but it's fine. We've pulled two four stars, so it's a very, very great day. Start off quite bad, but it's it's definitely, definitely picked up. So we have, uh, what is it, three of these to open, and then we got four fully formed. So this takes up, us up to 53, and are we going to get any gold in here? No, it's all, all bronze, all two-star champions. But to be honest, like, I'm cloud nine right now. We've got two four stars. Not exactly the ones that we wanted, but um, yeah, like guys, you certainly can't knock that. Okay, let's go for this batch of four. Ice Man or Archangel? Let's see one of those. Okay, we got, we got Captain Marvel. So yeah, that wasn't too bad at all. So out of, I think, 57 crystals, I think that was... Four three star champions and two four stars might have been might have been five three star champions actually I'm pretty sure it was four though gosh I can't remember for the life of me but let's finally open this uh this three star hero crystal and see what we get here so let's just pop this one open and we got another Captain Marvel which takes energy absorption up to sig 50 64 so yeah not too bad at all I'm just actually qu uh, quite curious now to see uh what sig level my uh, my guillotine is on because I need to take her back up to, uh, I think it's 440. Yeah, it's, it's 440 at least. So yeah, that's pretty decent for, what is it, X23 in the Labyrinth of Legends. So I need to rank her back up again, which is fine. She's Jupe Love Lady. Uh, I don't think I'll be putting any stones into her. I'll probably be saving that for my voodoo and stuff. So yeah, I'll just let, you know, that one sig level slide. But it ain't too bad. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this premium disappointment crystal opening. It was not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. Not really characters in terms of the four star that have, like, really impacted my roster. Because the Jeep levels on Guillotine and Black Bolt, they're not really doing anything, but it's a nice chunk of shards. It's good to get a couple of four stars from a uh, big batch of premium, so like, I don't mind that at all. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, if you did enjoy today's video, feel free to leave a like. Apart from that, thank you very much for watching. Take care and have an absolutely fantastic day.